Welcome back to Lucky Strike Tech. Got a quick video for you today. Today we're checking out a microphone by MRSDY. It's a USB microphone for PlayStation, PS5, PC, you know the deal. Let's see what's inside. Got your manual, pretty standard, a stand, and the microphone. Now the cable is automatically threaded on and we can enjoy the peel. Yeah, pretty satisfying. So it looks like it does work with any stand and even a boom arm if you need it to. So let's just screw her on. So aesthetics wise, it's got some claws on the side, nice dial. I'm not a big fan of the claws, but that's personal preference. But it does sit nicely and it's nice and sturdy and pretty well made for $30. So let's just plug this thing in and see what it looks like. Oh, actually this looks really nice lit up. And it looks like the RGB is not changeable or able to turn off. It does have a sound suppression button, in-ear monitoring, mute, and the mute option looks like it changes the microphone red when it's on. Now it does have a nice large volume knob smack dab in the middle that you'd use for changing the gain input. I spent the rest of the night testing this thing out. At first I wasn't a big fan of the looks, but over time it kind of grew on me. And the rest of my party said I sounded great. They didn't really have any issues hearing me. It was nice and clear. It actually didn't have any fan noise, even though I had a fan blowing right on me. And I didn't even have the noise cancellation on at the time. The only complaint I got is that I tapped my fingers quite a bit and everyone could hear that in the microphone. So that's why I can't use a microphone on my desk. But again, this thing attaches to a boom arm. Now this is where things take an interesting turn. This thing is $30 and the mic quality on this sounds fantastic. I don't think you can go wrong sound wise for this at all. And no matter where you are in the room, it can kind of Always make sure you sound generally the same. I'm not speaking up, by the way. Usually microphones I've tested in the $50 range are best sounding, but this one's 30 bucks and you can't go wrong with it sound-wise. Usually microphones in the $30 price range don't sound this good. Okay, so this thing does have a noise suppression toggle, so let's turn that on and see what it sounds like. Sound suppression is on, but currently it might sound a little fuzzier, but there's nothing to suppress right now. So let's test that out. Now I usually complain that my room is about 85 to 90 degrees in the summer when my PC's running. So I've got my desk fan running at highest speed right now, which I usually turn off for recordings. So sound suppression's on, fan is on blast. What does it sound like? Let me know in the comments below. Today's video was nice, short, and sweet. As a result, I found a cool product to look at. Now the looks did put me off at first, but being lit up, eh, it's not so bad, is it? And for only $30, you can't really beat it. Thanks for sticking around to the end of the video. If you wanna see more, make sure to like and subscribe. I'm hoping soon to do some videos about some cool tech for your desk that I incorporate in mine, some cool features that can make your life easier. And if you're a microphone manufacturer out there, one piece of advice, if you're gonna add RGB, make sure you can either change the color or turn it off. Thank you.